Good morning, everyone. Welcome to Midwest Market Solutions Insider Commentaries. Monday morning, it is August the 21st. Thanks for joining us here. We're seeing a little bit lower grain prices overnight. The dollar has weakened, but not by much, and uh, not enough to overcome the selling that was uh, noted in light volume in the grains overnight. Corn, beans, wheat all ending lower. Minneapolis wheat, the biggest leaders on the downside in the wheat market. Soybeans, the biggest losses in the overnight trade in the grains. Rains have fallen in parts of Iowa. The radar shows an impressive 48 inches in some local areas over the weekend in Iowa and uh, some areas badly needed it and the grains are trading off of these forecast uh, in the overnight. Now there's not a lot that's going to change things here I don't think. Uh, there is some forecast for a potential killing frost but it's going to be confined to northern areas of the belt, uh, maybe Wisconsin, northern Minnesota, not the main key growing areas in early September. And, but the forecast model, certainly it's a long ways out. Things can change. The full moon is forecast for September 6th, and that's always the coldest days of the month. So uh, certainly your area could receive some very cold temperatures, and that is going to be what's needed to give us a rally in corn and soybeans prior to the harvest uh, beginning. Otherwise, we're going to be sitting here with uh, much lower prices. Now, last year at this time, prices were lower, but producers found solace in the fact that they had some record-type yields in corn and soybeans. This year, there's very few producers who will suggest they have anywhere close to a record yield uh, on their particular farm operation. Livestock looks to be uh, kind of a mixed two-sided affair. Cutouts were down hard on Friday. News was bearish on Friday. Markets are a little bit oversold and could see some sort of a technical bounce in here, but I do think those rallies are going to be sold by the trade. Uh, we'll have much more information on our website as uh, the day progresses. Our Twitter feed is active. We've got uh, a lot of new followers. Thank you for following us there. If you're watching this video via Twitter, uh, make sure you sign up at our website for a free trial to our uh, website, our newsletters, and uh, we, our weekly and our daily newsletter gone out already to our clients. You can get those at our website, MidwestMarketSolutions.com. Call me directly, 417-501-5132 for more information. Have a great day trade. This has been Brian Hoops. Talk to you again soon.